Kajalu FS forward Milko Bielica has all the characteristics of a former Yugoslavia player. All my career, you know, since I started to play basketball, they, from all young selection, I start to, to learning uh, like all stuff, you know, because when you're young, there is no no position what uh, they can say because you are young, small like everybody, and nobody know what position you predict what you're gonna be. So, so in that years, you learning to I don't know to dribble, to shoot, to do layups, left, right hand, you know, uh, all around, you know, and. Uh, after a while, when you start to growing, you know, like you, they they giving you position. So I can say for myself that I'm technically complete, but uh, with my physical and my size, I think I can play. Uh, my position is four, and uh, I can play on the five as well. In his particular case, Milko's versatility comes from the fact he started playing in a very different role. I've been maybe 14 years old. All play, players, uh, kids grow before me, you know. Nobody know that I will grow up, you know, and I, I play like a pointer maybe because of that I know how to dribble the ball now better than other big guys, you know. And uh, after one year I, I grew up like 20 centimeters. Unbelievable, you know, nobody expect that and then I start to play like a center. And this is everything happened between 15 and 18 years old. That was the, the good thing that I, I've been taller, but from another way, there was no muscle and uh, weight what will follow this size, you know. I needed like four years maybe to get my, my body you know, fit, you know, to look like and to compare with other players. Now at almost 30 years old, all the work done in the past is paying off. I like to do everything. I I, I trying to to play smart and to reading, you know, different. So if I have open shot, for sure I I will do that, and I I like to score. It. For sure, my offense is my uh, better side, and uh, I try to score on uh, different ways. What is much harder for defense to defend. A vivid memory for Milko is the Euro Cup he won with Nieto Osritas in 2009. Also because it was a tough season. That was my first season in, in Ritas and how I remember, you know, that uh, we had some problems that, that year. But uh, Chuck Aitson and me, we, we was only foreigners and all the rest of the team was Lithuanian. And uh, that year we won all trophies, we won Lithuanian Cup, Championship, uh, Baltic League, like uh, President Cup and uh, Euro Cup on the end in the final against uh, Himki. Miko is playing his fifth Turkish Airlines Euroleague in a row after four ULEG Cups and one Euro Cup. But this is probably his strangest season. This season it's, it's a, little, a little bit different than uh, other seasons what I had in my career, you know, because first two months of this season I, I miss and then I signed a temporary contract with uh, Caja Laboral. And after that I came to FS, you know, so many things uh, happened, you know, in my career last six months. Right now I am in, uh, in FS, Istanbul, like different city than all other cities where I played before. Uh, different culture, different people, uh, but uh, on the good way, you know, I can say everything positive, you know, and uh, I'm happy where, where I am right now. At the top of such a brilliant career, Milko has always followed an idea that has guided him throughout the years. Meaning, if your value, like value, you know, it, it's the big, sooner or later you're going to show your quality. 